If you're like me and you want to create a bunch of tutorials on Windows, you're probably going to need a screen recorder. Cam Studio is one of the best in the business, not only having the benefits of being free, but also powerful enough to record amazing screen recording videos. It's the biggest form of middle finger that you can give to TechSmith's Camtasia. No offense. <laughs> In order to record the best video available, you're going to need to record it using a lossless codec, which you should download from the site link below. The lossless codec will produce an incredibly smooth and crisp video for your usual daily video activities. It is significantly better than the crap that was Microsoft Video 1. And if you're like me and you're using Sony Vegas to edit videos, you might want to drag the recorded video into Sony Vegas. However, this happens. Let's drag this into Sony Vegas. Let's drag this into Sony Vegas. Let's drag this into Sony Vegas. I said let's drag this into Sony Vegas. No, screw it. I'm, I'm done. I'm, I'm done. This, this video is to get this video off. Yeah, the lossless video doesn't work. Maybe there's something wrong with Cam Studio. Okay, so I checked into Cam Studio. It turns out that Cam Studio records a thousand FPS. I mean, don't get me wrong. It's going to make things a lot smoother with more FPS, but my rendered videos are only 30 FPS. So I don't think I'm going to need that much frames. Let's decrease it down to around 30 FPS. If you can't really get it to 30 or 60 or depending what kind of frames per second that you render on your videos, just go around that number. For me, I guess 40 should do it. Besides, recording in 1000 FPS means you're going to capture more frames. Capturing more frames means bigger file size, so we definitely don't want to waste too much space. Oh, and before we go even further, if you're editing in Sony Vegas, I recommend you to install two softwares that are essential on importing many types of video files into your Vegas project. First is QuickTime, and the next is Combined Community Codec Pack. I recommend CCCP because k Mega Codec Pack is swarmed with virus and unnecessary codecs that you might not need. The next step is to install a video converter. I highly recommend Handbrake for this tutorial. It's pretty freaking good. In Handbrake, let's drag this lossless AVI video and convert it to a compressed MP4. Change the codec to an MP4, set the constant quality to at least uh, 5. If you have a narration included in the recording, add an audio track. Make sure that the mix down is at stereo. After that, name your destination and start the conversion. Wait for a few minutes. Any minute now. Done. Now dropping the video in Vegas has worked perfectly and it's about as smooth as a baby's face. Thank you so much for watching this short tutorial. Please post your problems in the comments below and I will see if I can help in any way. If you like this, you can click the subscribe button and definitely thanks for watching.